here we go. So yeah, as you can see, well, in, in case I don't uh, manage it, uh, as you can see, uh, I am playing the game windowed here. Uh, not full screen, I'm hoping that will help me uh, actually catch the intro video as, uh, well, as a video. I mean, I'm getting working capture. Now, a few more things to say. Uh, this game was directed by none other than uh, Tim Schafer. I mentioned this in the uh, trailer video, of course. Uh, but I also want to point out that, well, uh, I also want to mention uh, some other games he's made uh, recently. Psychonauts, um, Broken Age, most memorably, and uh, uh, there was some other game with um, was it Mamushka dolls, those Russian uh, dolls within dolls. I, I don't remember the name of that game, uh, I never actually played it. Maybe I will in the future, but I do not have the opportunity to do so right now. Anyway, um, yeah, since this is a game by Tim Schafer, you can fully expect a quirky game. Quirky humor, quirky graphics, stylized uh, imagery, and just uh, quirks all around. Um, and yeah, well, I've spoken quite enough, so let's uh, let's just uh, go and do this. Um, hoping I get <laughs> um, actual sound from the uh, game as well. Oh, maybe move the papers. Okay, now I should be ready. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Sorry for the wait, Mr. Flores. I am ready to take you now. Take me? Take me where? Now, now. There's no need to be nervous. Nervous? No. It's just your appearance. It's a little intimidating. Intimidating? Me? But I'm your friend. My name's Manny Calavera. I'm your new travel agent. I don't want a new travel agent. I want to go home. <laughs> you can't go home, Celso. You're dead. But you're not alone. Everybody here is just as dead as you. That's why we call it the land of the dead. Are you ready for your big journey? No. What journey? The four-year journey of the soul. It is quite a big trip. And I can't lie to you, Celso. It could be very, very dangerous. Unless you were to take that money you were buried with and buy a better travel package from us. I mean, wouldn't you rather cross the land of the dead in your own sports car? Maybe try a luxury ocean cruise? Or, if you led a very good life, you may even be eligible for a ticket on the number nine itself. The number nine? That's our top of the line express train. It shoots straight to the ninth underworld, the land of eternal rest, in four minutes instead of four years. But very few people qualify. Let's take a look at your records. Hmm? Hmm. Bad news is the train appears to be just out of your reach, but I still got a couple of tricks up my sleeve here. Mm-hmm. Yeah ha! Yes, that's the ticket. The Excelsior Line. Yes, she's a beauty. That compass in the handle will sure come in handy, too. Oh, you're going to have a great trip. Wish I was going. Why don't you? You could give me a lift. Oh, I can't leave here until I've worked off a little debt to the powers that be. Community service, eh? Well, I guess there are some folks worse off than me. Oh, I'll be leaving here soon enough. No thanks to dead and no commission low-life cases like yours, Menso. Hey, Manny. The boss told me to tell you not to leave early tonight. He wants to talk to you about something when he gets back from his trip. Tell Don not to worry. I'm not going anywhere. Especially not with clients like that. Where do they get these guys? They don't qualify for anything good, so I can't sell anything good. Can't work off my time and I'm stuck. 
stuck selling walking sticks to a bunch of burros for eternity. I need better clients. I need a real saint. I need a lead on a rich, dead saint. Hmm. ¿Qué es esto? Oh, so now we are in the game proper. So, uh, the controls are, um, yeah, that's um, with the arrow keys and the numeric keypad. Let's just see what message we received. It's some sort of special work order. To all agents from office manager Don Copel. All right, you boneheads, thank you lucky stars and get to your friggin' cars. We have a mass poisoning on our hands. Too many dead to assign specific cases. So all clients are first come, first serve. So let's see some hustle out there. Whatever you say, Hiffy. <laughs> right, well, um, I just Examine the uh, volume levels a bit. I'm just going to turn down the in-game sound ever so slightly. Uh, how about that? Maybe that is better. Okay. Um, see, what am I looking at here? Uh, am I looking at anything? Uh, no. My computer gives me instant access to our database of deadbeats. Ooh, a minesweeper. Here's Celso's file. That walking stick was too good for him. Well, uh, he didn't sound all that bad to me, actually. Ah, the old files, the old clients, the glory days. When people okay. died with dignity um, and Domino Hurley didn't exist. Right. Well, that's, um... Yeah. Oh, uh, the controls are funny. Uh, it's n not Better my take these cards. The it looks like a long Talk day of solitaire minutes. for me. Okay, so about the controls. Um, the game engine here that they uh, designed for Grim Fandango, Grim E or Grime, depending on how you want to pronounce it, uh, was used, to my knowledge, in only two games. That is um, Grim Fandango, as it was apparently named after and Escape from Monkey Island, a game that uh, yeah, did not appeal to me. <laughs> okay, uh, let's just get out um, for the third bloody time. Uh, now, I can't actually see it myself because the uh, window here is... well, yeah, I'm playing with the game windowed, uh, or uh, well, otherwise it seemed I wouldn't catch any, uh, well, game footage. I actually have a slight texture mod activated in the uh, virtual machine settings. Oh, um, in case you hear anything funny, that's uh, some fighter jet flying by for some reason. They do that once in a while. Buenos dias. Manny, why aren't you at the poisoning? What poisoning? Yeah, the Code 3 gazpacho poisoning that everybody's at but you! Why do I send out memos if nobody reads them? Where was the poisoning again? Just ask your driver for crying out loud, he'll know. Any messages for me? Besides the one about the poisoning? Yeah. I only have one other message for you, Manny. I'm not your secretary. I don't take your messages. So get it through your thick skull and stop forwarding your phone to me. All right. But that sounded more like four messages to me. Busy as ever, I see. I'd have more work to do if you had more clients. Ouch. Where is everybody? Oh, Manny, did you forget what day it is today? Oh, man, did I come in on Saturday again? It's the Day of the Dead. Everybody's back in the land of the living, visiting their families like we should be. So, um... If you know your uh, folklore, you will already have realized that this uh, game is, of course, uh, 
based on uh, this uh, Latin American uh, tradition, I think, about with the Day of the Dead and Calavera dolls and uh, sugar sculptures and uh, things. Um, so, well, since this is like <laughs> the uh, third time I'm going through this in a short period of time, uh, I hope you can uh, forgive me if <laughs> I'm not quite on the ball, actually. Uh, but let's just go through this uh, dialogue tree here. It's, um, <laughs> it's pretty funny. Uh, th th this game is one of the funniest games I have ever played, hands down. Um, it it's even funnier than, <laughs> South uh, than the uh, South Park game that just released, The Stick of Truth. Only uh, this time it's, uh, well, family friendly. Until the point where you stick a scythe in the, in, the, in the eye of a giant octopus, but yeah. Um, uh, one thing at a time. Why aren't you visiting your family today? Ah, the boss is here, so I gotta be here. How about you, Cal? No one back there I want to see. And you don't want Domino here alone, getting all the good leads. Domino's here? He's at the poisoning right now, stealing your commission. The son of a bitch. Yeah. So there's a bit of rivalry, rivalry between Manuel Calavera and Domino Hurley, his uh, office neighbor. And uh, well, this is also a bit of a film noir inspired game. So that should tell you a few things right there. But uh, let's just um, go through the game. So, you going to the Christmas party? After the spectacle you made of yourself last year, I wouldn't miss it for the world. Um, so what happened uh, on the Christmas party last year? Um, Any good gossip? Well, I heard Domino got a raise. Por favor, tell me some good news, why don't you? I still love you. You're all I really need, Bayesa. <laughs> huh, I don't think I, I actually uh, got that message before. Well, I gotta go hit the bricks. Okay, you show those bricks a lesson. Okay. It's a hole punch. Could I take your hole punch? Ha! <laughs> I doubt you could take my half punch. Hmm, I wonder if maybe I should turn the game volume down even further. Uh, okay. Well, I'll just uh, listen listen um, to the video before I upload it. Yeah. Okay, so let's just um, do this first. Thanks, but I got solitaire on the computer, Manny. <laughs> oh, really? Manny, what are you doing? Just marking cards, honey. Mind if I use your hole punch? Knock yourself out. Ooh. <laughs> Thanks. Gets the aggressions out, doesn't it? Yeah. Okay. So, uh, that will have to be enough for the first little um, session here. As you can see, I have... Uh, yeah, that's from the uh, previous uh, attempt that I had to, well, scrap, unfortunately, because it did not record. Uh, okay, so let's just name something, and... Uh, yeah. I will now examine the video and I will see you in the next part.